which topics might come up for OCRA A-Level Biology 2025. Well, that's what we're gonna be talking about in this video. I've gone through every past paper for OCR since 2015, and I've picked out some key patterns and trends of what gets commonly assessed on paper one and what hasn't come up recently. And from this, I'm gonna be sharing with you what I'd be focusing on if I was doing my A-Levels this year. Now, that doesn't mean I wouldn't revise everything, it's just one element of what I would focus on. Hey everyone, and welcome to Miss Estrick biology and what I'm going through in this video is I'm sharing my findings from my OCRA past paper analysis in particular paper one. Now these are not predictions of what I think or I'm saying is coming up in paper one for 2025. This is me simply sharing my data analysis of every past paper, what is commonly assessed and what hasn't come up recently and therefore I'd recommend that when you're planning your revision of topics make sure that the topics that come up frequently and the ones that haven't come up recently, and in particular if it's in both of those categories, that you have multiple sessions that you're going to be revising them. But you still need to revise everything because this is just data analysis and patterns and trends, but it could be useful to help you prioritize your revision. So let's dive into it, starting with the most commonly assessed topics for paper one, OCR biology. Number one, transport in animals. Number two, transport in plants. Number three, photosynthesis. Number four, respiration. So those are some fundamental topics and they come up the most often for OCRA paper one. So I'd make sure that you have interleaved those into your revision multiple times. Number two, I'm gonna be talking you through which topics haven't been assessed as much in the most recent years. Now that doesn't mean that they they're definitely coming up in 2025, but it might mean they're more likely to. So it's worth making sure you know them completely. You've done lots of past paper questions covering them. So let's have a look at the list. Transport in plants. This has been missing from recent exam. Number two, respiration. This is usually a commonly assessed topic and it also hasn't featured heavily recently. Number three, nucleotides and nucleic acids. There's been very little coverage of this in the exams recently. Number four is cell division and number five, is enzymes. So those haven't been assessed much recently and transport in plants and respiration fall under both topics. Commonly assessed and hasn't been assessed much recently. So I definitely make sure you are confident on those topics and you've done lots of past paper questions on them. But there are others on that list which are fundamental topics which haven't featured much in the recent years. Next, let's think about some of the key practicals and data analysis as well. OCR loves to test experiments experimental skills in paper one. And in particular, what I've noticed come up a lot in paper one are these skills. Analyzing, planning, and evaluation. So that is from your module one. And graph interpretations and calculations as well. So just make sure you are confident on being able to describe why you might have a certain set of equipment, your control variables, or control experiment, independent variables, and all sorts of things linked to the planning, as well as the data analysis and calculations. So that is it. It was a short one. I wanted to get straight to the point, sharing with you commonly assessed, not come up recently, and the practical skills to help you come up with a bit of a plan for your revision. Now, if you do need help making sure you understand some of those key topics, then I have now got my OCRA 2025 notes fully updated, checked by an examiner who wrote all the examiner's tips in them for me. And yes, that's one of the main additions to my notes. My notes now include examiner tips for every subtopic and questions and answers for every subtopic so that you can not only learn the information, you get an insight into what the examiners are looking for on those mark schemes and questions and answers to help you to remember it. So I'll link that below to help you prepare for these commonly assessed topics and what might come up in OCRA paper one for 2025. But that is it for this video. Hope you found it helpful and I'll see you in the next one. And look out for what's coming up potentially in OCR paper two and three in the next videos. 